Hello everyone and welcome back to Fortnite event. I'm gonna make a really fast video on how to complete this week challenges. And for the first challenge, you need to go to two or visit two locations. The first location is here. Just land directly at this area. Actually, no one lands here and maybe Fortnite. That's why I asked you to do that quest. So anyways, once you land here, as you can see, this is the first area. And the second location, guys, which is the first pipe pole, as you can see, whoa, this awesome cave. Actually, also no one lands in this area. Anyways, this is the exact location for it. It's in just in front of this main location. Yeah, here exactly. So just come to here, and this will be your second spot. And for this quest, guys, simply go to any location that contains these grind rails, like here. Or at Mega City, there's actually a bunch of these at, around the map. So go to any of the location and ride it. Then press the sprint key in your keyboard. And as you can see, I'm actually sprinting on the wheels like this. Just press the sprint key on your keyboard. And for our next challenge, guys, you need to get or take damage from enemy player and survive for 30 seconds. So simply, what you're gonna do is staying in the open until someone hits you once it doesn't matter who hits you you can do that this by the way also in team rebel so let's see i see a player most likely this is a bot so this is a perfect example just make him hit you once come on bro you can do it you can do it you can hit me once come on come on come on, come on. you can do it oh my god guys tell him he can't do it okay now he hit me once what i gonna do is just run away and i make sure that i survive for 30 seconds that's it and yes, that's pretty much the second challenge, which is actually quite easy as well to do. And for the next quest, guys, simply you need to mark a character or enemy player. So just go to a location that contains a character, like for example, this one, or any other location by going to characters, you will know all the other location for the character. So go to any of these characters and simply mark this character by pressing like this. If you don't know how to mark, simply go to settings and here under controllers go all the way down until you find communications okay i think it's up there yeah yeah communication and here you will find place place marker and just choose the button you want to use to place the marker and that's how you can complete this quest and for the last challenge guys you need to kill a player enemy player with a submachine gun and this actually came back like the last week and you can find this one pretty much everywhere inside the chest floor loot or everything else and once you get this gun you need to find a real player or a bot or anything and just kill that player that bot or that player with a submachine gun and that's how you can simply complete that challenge Thanks a lot guys for watching, don't forget to subscribe and see you guys in the next one. Bye!